media partners, judges, specially invited guests, teachers, students, boys and girls, good afternoon. Welcome once again to the sixth staging of Jamaica's Best School Band. My name is Michelle, I'll be your host for today. This evening is going to be an experience that we want to experience, that we will be experiencing, all right? Our students will be bringing live music to the stage. After weeks and months of rehearsal, we'll be sitting right here enjoying every moment of it. We're going to be good students and members of the audience will be cheering for all our band members. Our love will be felt in every shape and form after each band has performed. A competition of this nature could not have happened without judges because as you know, at the end of the day, the bragging rights is going to go to one of the schools that will be named Jamaica's best school band. So, we have some esteemed people that will be helping us today with the judging. There is one lady in our midst, so it's only fair to start with her. All right. She is Sharita Lewis. Sharita is a past student of Edna Manley. <laughs> Conversation in key. Give Sharita a round of applause. <laughs> Sharita is also a voice trainer. She has arranged harmonies for almost every artist in Jamaica, I'm told. She has written songs for people like Taurus Riley, Etana, among others. She is presently one of Damian Marley's harmony singers. So guess what is going to happen now? At some point, Sharita is looking on stage for harmonies. She is looking for uh, players of instrument. And guess what? You might just join up with Dave and Molly one of these days. You just walk through the airport. I hear one of the Molly's on the radio. Friday. Um, oh, not one of the popular Julia. Julia. Julian is saying, you know, sometimes I go to the airport and I say, yo, can you have money? Sometimes they don't ask me no question. Yeah, yeah, man. Sometimes they just draw up on the phone and I say, go through. So guess what? Sherry, tell me why you so go through the airport and you don't ask me none. All right? So you want to do your very best. A round of applause for Sherry tonight. All right? We have another member, another esteemed person. We went to do it because we have to say, guess what? The elders. I forget the biggest thing also, the one was last. Everybody has never said so. Deal! Alright? The other person we have with us is Denver Feluki Smith. Anybody know anything about Denver? Hear about Denver? Yeah. Alpha! What are they? Alpha! Yo! Yeah! Denver is a past student uh, of Alpha Boy School. He is a musical director. He also is a double Grammy Award winning percussionist. Anybody know that? I think that. He's a master drummer. He's a producer. He's a songwriter. He has done touring like never before. He also has a song. Anybody know what any of them has song? Anybody know any of them has song? Anybody? No! Hold on, hold on. Some people are not a part of it. Anybody that is working with JB has been not a part of it. No, 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 not a part of it. Anybody else? Anybody know the name of the song? Luke here, man. Say Luke. That's his name. Go look here now. Anybody? All right. You see when you finish? There's a song called Soul Alive. I wanna keep my soul alive. Mod song. The video is even more beautiful. A round of applause for Say Luke. We have the other boss, the bigger boss, the up top boss. And he's got Lloyd Parks, we call him Lloydy. Lloyd Parks of We the People Band, master bass player. Earlier this year, he celebrated his 44th anniversary in music. A wonderful concert it was, really beautiful concert. He is or was the backing band for Dennis Brown and many others. He has been with the JBSB from the inception. Officially, the greatest supporter of JBSB time. 
line provision of sound backline instruments, everything you can't have all. <laughs> all right, just for a reminder, we will be having the quarterfinal of what we're what we're looking, what we're looking for. We're looking for planning and preparedness, originality, interaction with the audience, quality of performance, and presentation. All right, so please bear that in mind. Remember the quarterfinal round, the theme foundation rules. Each school was given about six songs. A music list was prepared for us by Meritone Disco. And we were, the schools were expected to choose two or three of those songs and any of those that fit the theme that we talk, we're talking about here now. Foundation rules. Semi-finals, you will be doing an original song and the best of your piece. Please know this year there's going to be an award for the best original song. So I hope it's going to come good because it will make that determination. At the end of each performance, Sharita is going to give us a feedback, a very short feedback. We're going to be looking at our strengths and areas for improvement because, as you all know, what we want from this project is for growth and development of students and bands. Luki, Denver, is just going to say a few words as to what the judges are looking for. Excuse me, what a band, what we want to achieve from a band. So, Feluke, please just take, take. Um, I just know that we're, we'll be looking for, like, you who is at the front here. Looking for, like, that, that's something we have right now. Yeah, that's something we are looking right through the show. And the support system and discipline and how we interact with each other. So guess what? Jump into it, and we could do it. Have some fun, all right? What if fun? Thank you, Faloke. All right, just be reminded, each, each band is expected to perform for 10 minutes, right? We have a timekeeper. We do have a timekeeper. Remember, foundation rules. And here I'm going to go on. The foundation, I'm going to kick off. However,